Motorcycle ride hailing firm Angkas will be providing free rides for medical frontliners starting tomorrow amid the suspension of public transportation under the modified ECQ. Romel Lopez has the story. Despite still not being allowed to operate on the roads yet due to lack of franchise, motorcycle ride hailing firm Ancas will be ferrying passengers over the next two weeks for free. The free ride covers medical frontliners in MECQ areas that's set to start on Saturday. Kasi itong ating mga health workers, probably sa umaga, okay pa yung biyahe nila, masigla pa. Pero after their shift, ito yung mga pagod na. So nakastandby sila doon para ihalit sila ng bahay. Ang kas assured riders that their salaries will be paid. One of the measures na ginagawa po ng gobyerno at ng pribadong sektor na partnership. Angkas also donated 1,000 units of motorcycle barriers to the Philippine National Police to be distributed to prisons for medical frontliners in the area. Interior Secretary Eduardo Año tested the barriers. He vouched for the barrier safety and its potential in curbing the spread of COVID-19. He said that there are studies showing its positive results. Kasi ang virus ay uh, nagtatravel uh, by airborne. Ang nangyayari ay 20%, I mean 30% na ating mga gumagamit ng motor. After a while, itinataas nila yung kanilang face shield. Siguro na iinitan. Kapag nagkaroon ng uh, traffic o kaya nasa intersection, tinatanggal nila yung kanilang helmet o itinataas yung face shield. Instinct nila yan, hindi mo mapigilan sapagkat kung ang komportable na yung tao, talagang gagawin niya yung, para, yung paraan para guminawa siya. He also clapped back against the critics of the mandatory installment of plastic barriers. Sino ba ang merong, uh, merong responsibilidad sa pagliligtas ng buhay? Ang ating health workers, ang ating frontliners, ang ating uh, local and national government. Nasa kanila yan. Mangyari nga dyan, kasama sa mga sa mga mabibiktima o magkakaroon ng sakit, ang takbo niya, dito pa rin sa ating national local government, sa mga law enforcers. No? Anya hopes that the MECQ will not be extended as there is a need to balance the public health with the country's economy.